Hey, what's up? It's you, Lee Valverick here again with another video, and today I have a highly anticipated video. This has been my most requested, probably got like three or four people asking for this, but this is how the my Yeezy Boost 350 custom has been holding up. Um, long story short, it's it's I hold up pretty well except for the paint, but which is partially my fault. We'll get to that in a, a second. But as you can see, all along the midsole, the brown is where I put the leather dye which um stayed on it was supposed to be black leather dye but for some reason it turned brown slash red so that's why you don't need that but it is good because when the paint chips off it's not just complete white showing through you still have a little bit of color so it's not too noticeable but so that stayed on but the black paint i only did one coat so uh it came off which i need to do another coat soon maybe today so as i was saying you can see um all along the midsole you have cracking along here i don't know if this probably also just depends on how your shoes wear i have a lot of um pressure right here on the ball of my foot and actually right here on the ball of my foot that's not the ball of my foot um and i'm a heel striker also so as you can see along here not too much cracking but as you get in the back a little bit right there i'll just keep on going oh right here is really bad as you can see the little thingy right here don't know what it's called i'll call it a little heel shank um, that is chipping up pretty bad, and it doesn't look good either. You can see that that looks pretty worn right there. So that's probably the worst part of the shoe, I'd say, maybe. Um, going along, you can just see right there again, a lot of cracking. Next shoe, about the same thing. More cracking up here. Good in the, um, midfoot. Then towards the heel, more cracking. And... Same with the lateral side. So, um, anyways, keep in mind, this is after probably, gosh, like, 11 or 12 wears. I've been putting these things to work. I love these things. My favorite shoe by far. Um, but the thing is, it kind of, okay, so the first couple wears, um, they were fine. Didn't see much cracking. Then it started to crack a little bit. Then that's when the cracking started. It kind of started cracking ever since then and it kind of stopped around like maybe eight or nine wears but um so ever since i wore it since then it's kind of just been the same not much more cracking um so i'm gonna put a couple more layers on this which i'll probably make a follow-up follow video on um uh go check my other two videos i had a video of the a great tutorial on how to do this but for some reason the video got like half cut off so i made a fo another follow-up video go check those two if you want to um, see how to customize your Ultra Boost to make them look like this. I basically did Yeezy Boost 350 um, lacing. I think it looks sick if you can't afford the real Yeezys like me, or well, I can't afford them, I just can't afford the resale price for retail maybe. Hoping to get the ones in that drop this December. I tried to get the Moon Rocks. Struck out, struck, didn't even try online because that's just too crazy. I tried Barney's, I tried, um, then I tried another couple boutiques that are in San Francisco. Struck out on all those, but, um, so anyways, thank you guys for watching. Please like, subscribe, and comment if you guys like seeing this channel, and I'll see you guys next time. Peace, and stay safe out there.